Derek with the Lemonex, Highland Park, New Jersey. I went after this bald-faced hornet's nest yesterday. It's quite active. And uh, I, I sprayed it with a uh, non-repellent uh, water-based insecticide. So they were all able to go back into the nest uh, without being disturbed. So I'm coming here the next day to remove it safely. Usually I could just, usually just hack it down. See if I can take this thing in one piece. I forgot to get my pruning shears. Forgot to get my pruning shears. That's a great, that's not, one came out. <laughs> one came out. So I'm going to take it over here. A couple are alive and kicking inside. So most likely a returning bee, but uh, with the, uh, the contact residual, they they affect each other. At about 99% of them die overnight. There's some larvae in there. That pupate. There's probably a, a hundred, hundreds of bees in there dead. It's a safe, safe extraction of the bee's nest without getting stung. That one did come out. There was one hovering, hovering about, but he's infected. He probably came in late at night. Probably more resilient, but he'll wander off. There's no bee's nest to tend to. So I'm going to bag this up and go off to the next job. And that's it. So it would be a nice uh, souvenir, but it'll start smelling because all the dead, the larva in there and everything. Usually the nest that you can save uh, for display purposes would be like a dead a nest that's been dead over the season, like throughout the winter. And everything dried up or froze and dried up. But this wouldn't be, uh, it'd be too hazardous to save that. It's start having a lot of odor and deteriorating right away. Here's one of the bees. Here's a few of the bees that died from the nest. Just to contact. They were quite active even after I sprayed. 20 minutes after I sprayed, uh, none of them died. It takes time. They have to ingest it. And it kills them pretty rapidly once they ingest it. But, but they still do their thing. And they all come in contact with the chemical. <sighs> That's it. And Derek with the Lemon X, Sarahville, New Jersey. Have a good day.